Hi there, they're my good friends of YouTube. Uh, another video on YouTube. Uh, this is me and my friend Paul behind who's holding the camera. Say hello, Paul. Hello. Hello there. Hello there. Mala mala. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what we got today is uh, if Paul can hold the fucking camera straight. Sorry about me swearing there, bit of a French toast. Uh, what it is, uh, today we've got this glass jar over that electrode coming out of the 150 kV transformer. Got the um, federal connection coming out there onto this bracket here, which was made some time ago, and anode and cathode, or whichever way you want it. <clears throat> so there we go. Uh, 25 volts going into the transformer through an RGBT, frequency driven from the frequency generator down here. And uh, right here we go then. I might actually turn the light off for the for the. I'll show it first with the light on, then the light off. I've got a bit of tape around the um, glass jar in case it actually shatters. The last thing we want is bits of brown glass everywhere. It's insane that, isn't it? Mm. Okay, the glass jar moving up. Mm. Can you hear the Static, aren't you? Let's try that with the light off. <laughs> All right. You see me? Yeah. That's crazy, that is. Absolutely Proper crazy. crazy. Ooh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> <sighs> it's getting a bit chilly. Right, I think I might go to, to, go to the Outback, you know? Not the Outback, should I say. The uh, North Pole. <laughs> Keep me tabs warm. <laughs> Sorry about that, I'm a bit of a strange moment. Oh, that's a strange moment, so I've got my friends around. <laughs> Can't be uh, too serious doing these things. You can actually hear internal arcs through the actual plastic of the PVC coming out of the federal. Mm, definitely. <clears throat> but uh, we actually, me and Paul actually did this, we did this first because we wanted to actually burn a hole through the uh, through the glass with the hot arc, you know, we, we did we, when I did with the glass, and when we started doing this, we noticed the output from how it was around the glass jar. So I thought, I thought, well, I might as well make a video and show that to uh, to you guys. But, uh, but yeah, that's that's pretty pretty insane. I might see if I can actually change the frequency and see if we can get an actual hot arc to come through there. Eventually, it may burn a hot spot onto the top of the glass and burn a hole through it, but uh, we'll have to see see how it goes. No, 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 there, watch there. All right, Jesus Christ, I'm cooking. Turn the heater off. All right, here we go. Let's get that uh, electrode a little bit closer. God, you can certainly hear that. Oh, I just felt a little bit of a static. Try that a little bit closer. Zone. Stinks. Doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Let's give it some more power. Oh, that's the most. Yeah, it's 25 volts. That's all I can give with this power supply. Mm -hmm. It's just connected to the Variac. Probably shatter the glass.
Excuse me. <laughs> I'm going to have to put some more voltage through that, I think, to enable us to burn an hole through it. Mm. Catch it to Variac. Right then guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. That's pretty pretty crazy stuff. There you can see look at the glass jar and the electrode coming straight out of the federal there. And uh, <clears throat> there's the RGBT, there's the driver, there's a the frequency generator which goes into the input of the driver, which drives the the gate of the RGBT. And there's a the power supply. So uh Hey, enjoyed that. Thanks for watching. Look after yourselves. Be safe, whatever you're doing. And uh, we'll speak again. Bye.